You gonna finish this any time today? I can't work with you watching me. Get over it. It's me now. Did I ask? I ain't none. Yeah, but I've just started my new job. Checking out our employee of the month. I can't believe you give him a job. We're calling it a trial. But why? It's a puzzler. What do you want? Nothing. I mean, how many X's can you fit in one garage? Don't start. There is no way that he would walk straight into another job. Especially a job that he doesn't even know how to do. So what do you do, Mum? Do you beg Kane to take him off your hands? No, I never said a word. Yeah, right. See you later. Oi, where are you off to? The car. Well, I'll make you something. Yeah, I just want a break, OK? Oi, feet! What? what? Are you trying to say those boots are clean? I can see something hanging off them. Doesn't like rose petals. Thank you. She's broke her arm, and I'm the only one who can look after her. Look, will you stop following me? You do me, Edin. I know it's my first day, but I have to go. I'll be gone a week, two max. Fine. Whatever. Go on. Off you go. Thanks, Ron. But don't expect pain. Why are you giving your mum a hard time? Why is that any of your business? You want to get your facts straight. I've just employed the biggest waste of space in the world, but I did it because I needed a mechanic. Not for your mum. I don't do favours. Yeah? So, uh, what were you two talking about, then? She wasn't very happy about it. She's done a few things she regrets, and most of them work over at that garage. So lighten up, kid. It's not the end of the world. It's not worth starting any fires over, do you know what I mean? Now, she can handle it. I don't see why you can't. Are we done yet? In one day, people will talk. Took care. Good for you. Brip? Yeah, thanks. Why did you really take Alex on? I'm beginning to ask myself the same question. He's already let me down, gone off to see his gran. Plus, that accent goes right through me. I didn't do it for you, if that's what you're wondering. Cross my mind. Wow. You must have a very high opinion of yourself. Oh, whether you meant it or not, you've done me a favour. I've done you more than one, if you remember. Not that I meant saving Holly's life. Not grasping your arsonist son. Right, right. So what are you after in return? He says I'm after anything. I might just like his company. Not in the way that you do, Yeah, but... can we not mention that? Not making any promises. Well, thanks, anyway. Actually, there is something you could do for me. I knew it. My dad needs a bit of work. You want me to give Zach a job? That's all I'm asking. I'll think about it. Before you start, Kane isn't here. He's not hiding under the table. I've been having secret meetings with him on my own. Yeah, yeah, I get the message. Do you? So you don't want to interrogate me? This isn't a love letter. It's a check to Paddy. It's overdue. Yeah, all right, Mum, give it a rest. I wasn't going to say anything, all right? I can say that if you want, but I might go to the pub. Right. Do you want to come? What do you mean? You won't be embarrassed to be seen with me? Well, I could cope as long as you're buying. So what's brought this on? Well, I might have just overreacted just a little bit, so mm. uh, I thought I'd make it up to you. So you're not going to go off and one of Kane's in there? Nope. We've sorted it. We've what? Yeah, yeah. Don't worry about it. Now, are you coming or not? You've twisted my arm. Hey, got a check for you. Cheers, thank you. Uh, are you going for a drink? Uh, yeah, why? Well, do you mind if I join you? Well, we haven't really finished a little chat yet. You don't need to say anything else. I'll see you in the morning. 
Got it trained up, has he? Marlon, shouldn't you be behind there? Night off. You couldn't do as a pizza, could you? It's just that Debbie's taking Sarah over to Lisa. I'm really starving. Do your own pizza, you lazy. Yeah, I suppose. No, you couldn't. You want to take a leaf out of her book? She's got Marlon right under the thumb already. Um, can I get you a drink? Why would I want a drink off a pie faced slapper like you? Pie faced? Please don't call my mum a slapper, Vic. No, no, don't you mean pole faced? Because she can look quite pole faced. Betty? Hmm? Stay out of it. Oh, no. I mean pie faced. Face like a pie. All right. I just came over to apologise. But if you're going to be childish. Go on, pie face. Jog on. Um, I'll get there, Diane. Why is that? Well, I was hoping to see you, actually. I thought we might be able to help each other out. Oh, exactly. Well, I seem to have lost a farmhand. Oh, yeah, I heard. Mm. And I was hoping that you'd be interested in earning a few quid. Offer me a job? That's right. You have to let that go. I know. Oi! What have I just said? I will have that drink. OK. Bottle of wine, please, to take out. <laughs> what? Are you having a laugh? <laughs> she can have what she wants. <clears throat> Don't drink it all on your own. I won't. I'm not giving any to that skank. It, she just bought that. I was on about Kerry. Yeah, I need that. At least that's sorted then. All right, you ready to go? No, it's only early. I know, I know. I'm just knackered, that's all. Why are you acting like a pensioner? You know what you need. A girlfriend. <laughs> wow, where did that one come from? Well, you're in the pub with your mum. You haven't had a night out since... Well, I don't know. You need to get out there. I can't, can I? Because I spend all my life on the farm. Which is why we need Zach. Oh, yeah? And uh, whose idea was that? Do you have a problem with him? Mm -mm. No. Except he's just a bit old. Are you sure he's up to it? There's only one way to find out. Hi, right, Zach. Have you given it any more thought? Are you sure you want me working for you? Yeah, I need someone. Right. Well, I'll give it a go, then. I'll have my notice in tomorrow. Great. You start Monday? Yeah, bright and early. You can rely on me. Good. <laughs> 